Vanessa Freeman. Yeah, I'm Dan Manorino in for John Muller this morning. We begin this morning with look at your weather and your traffic, and it's a nasty morning out there, Marissa. We've had a series of tornado warnings uh, throughout the overnight hours. We're still watching one north of the city. This tornado warning in effect till 515 this morning, uh, tracking through Putnam, Rockland, Westchester counties. You guys still have the warning in effect. Cities would be Clarkston, Cortland, Greenberg, Mount Pleasant as it continues to move northeasterly. Now we are watching this, and I will say as we head northward, it does look to be weakening a little bit, but still an area of concern. So one we're going to continue to watch. So if you're coming down 684 uh, through Mont Kisco, this is moving rather quickly uh, at at least 30 miles per hour. Things on the turnpike a little bit slower than normal as they should because it's wet. If you're flying out of Newark Airport, seeing a plane that's moving across, but you should probably check with your carrier if you have anybody coming in or flying out. We'll have another update in about um, 10 minutes, guys. Back to you. All right, Maris, thank you so much. Still ahead right here on the PIX11 Morning News. Health experts say that cough may not be COVID as we learn about the lesion outbreak in Joe Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris will get an update from their security team on the situation now ongoing in Afghanistan. This as members of both sides of the aisle are criticizing how the Biden administration has handled this very delegate withdrawal. PIX 11's Marvin Scott. Well, two questions. Number one, mm -hmm. I, you know, I, the one guy, the guy, that guy was very brave to kill, but you know, are they just kind of hanging around? How do you, you got to be looking for it to see it because it looks like they blend in. For it. They do. They actually don't fly very far, uh -huh. but when they do invade, they set up shop and they just take trees out. They oh, threaten like great production areas so folks who love wine. Yeah. If oh. they really infest, they could take out trees there, yeah. hop trees, walnut. It's yeah. And my it's, second question is, where could Red Mock get that polo? <laughs> You want it? We still have a jackknife tractor trailer on 287 northbound. So this is right near Morris Avenue. Three lanes blocked and one lane trying to get by. But that's why you have some heavy delays as you try to get through this area and up through Morris Plains there. So we're watching them. blocking three lanes right near exit 36. So this is the delay that you're looking at. Not horrible. You have one lane that is kind of trickling. New York on. City's comeback from the pandemic does continue today. The next Homecoming Week concert is going down tonight at the Brooklyn Army Terminal. Performers include Big Daddy Kane, designer and CNC Music Factory. This all, of course, leading up to the big concert Saturday in Central Park, where Bruce Springsteen and Jennifer Hudson are set to perform. Pix 11's Craig. Lines. We're right. starting with the parents one because okay. you know. So is this a baby superhero? Well, it could be. Could be right? It could be funny superhero because okay. it's like a superhero and then the comedian. Well, I know we have so many have so many celebrities that weekend in the city. Good for us. So we're less than a Katie Albert, yeah. the guest from She Ball on yeah. this hour, but we're having some issues and okay. all that, but I will make sure she shows up someday. Regardless. 10 a.m. hour. Thanks for staying with us, everybody. I'm betting because T-Mobile did acquire them in mm -hmm. the recent merger. It's a good question, Betty. A lot of people are wondering that. But and like she said the same thing. If you see it, kill it. So it's this bug that was talking it. about? And oh, now that I'm it. looking at it, I got to tell you, I was at the park last week with my kids in Jersey City. And? And I saw one of these. I didn't know what it was. We were like, oh, what a cute bug. And they were playing with it and whatnot.